the Days of These Kings, the Book of Daniel in Preterist Perspective by J. Rogers. Audiobook Part 40. Part 2 Notes on Daniel. Daniel 9. Is there a break in the 70th week? Daniel 9. Is there a break in the 70th week? In the introduction to this book, I explained how a misinterpretation of the last verses of Daniel 9 by the dispensationalist system necessitates a break in the 70th week. Dispensationalists say that Christ was crucified in the middle of the 70th week. Then the clock stops for a break of about 2,000 years to bring us to the current time. The dispensationalist looks for the 70th week to resume with the coming of the Antichrist and a revived Roman Empire. There is no indication in Scripture that there is a break in the 70 weeks of Daniel that leads us to the time of Christ and then picks up again during the future. I see the 70 weeks as continuous. The best possible explanation of Daniel is the preterist interpretation. The events described in Daniel were fulfilled before or during the generation of Jesus Christ. I also do not see a problem with a chronology that has the destruction of the temple at Jerusalem beginning some 40 years after the 70-week, 490-year time period was fulfilled. In AD 30, the sacrifices ceased to have any effect when the Messiah was cut off, causing the sacrifice and the oblation to cease. Daniel 9:26-27. It is also not necessary to find in Daniel an exact chronology that describes the destruction of the temple in AD 70. We find that 40-year chronology in Matthew, Mark, and Luke. This generation shall not pass till all these things be fulfilled. Matthew 24, 34. See, for instance, Matthew 16, 28, 23, 36, Mark 13, 30, 31, Luke 11, 50, 21, 32, 33. This concurs with Calvin's commentary on Daniel. But we are now treating a profanation of the temple, which should prove, if I may use the phrase, eternal and irreparable. Without the slightest doubt, this prophecy was fulfilled when the city was captured and overthrown, and the temple utterly destroyed by Titus, the son of Vespasian. This satisfactorily explains the events here predicted. Calvin, Commentary on Daniel 9, 27. Calvin has all of the 70 weeks of Daniel 9 fulfilled in successive chronological order prior to AD 70, agreeing with the preterist view.